The efficient mass production of protein bars involves advanced machinery and rigorous quality control, with the market projected to reach more than $6 million by 2029. The production of protein bars begins with sourcing and preparing the raw materials. Factories typically procure large quantities of protein sources such as whey, soy, or pea protein, along with other ingredients like oats, nuts, dried fruits, sweeteners, and flavorings. Large industrial mixers blend the ingredients into a homogeneous mixture. The mixing process is crucial as it ensures that the protein and other ingredients are evenly distributed throughout the mixture, providing a consistent texture and flavor in every bar. Factories utilize programmable logic controllers to automate the mixing process, allowing for precise control over the mixing time, speed, and temperature. This automation ensures that each batch is consistent, regardless of the scale of production. Once the mixture is thoroughly blended and homogenized, it undergoes a critical step of compression into long sheets before being extruded into individual bars. This compression process is pivotal for shaping the mixture into a form that is suitable for further processing. Equipped with large rollers or presses, the sheeting machine exerts pressure on the mixture, compacting it into a thin, uniform sheet. This step ensures uniformity in texture and flavor throughout the entire batch, crucial for maintaining consistency in the final product. Additionally, compressing the mixture increases its density, making it easier to extrude and shape into individual bars without crumbling or breaking apart. The protein bar mixture is transferred to the forming and shaping machines. These machines use a combination of extrusion and cutting technologies to shape the mixture into bars. The extrusion process involves forcing the mixture through a die to create a continuous bar that is then cut to the desired length by high-speed cutters. This method allows for the production of bars in various shapes and sizes, depending on the specific requirements of the product. The machinery is designed to handle high volumes of mixture, ensuring that thousands of bars can be produced per hour.
Many protein bars are coated with chocolate, yogurt, or other coatings to enhance flavor and texture. In this phase, the shaped bars pass through an enrobing machine, which evenly coats them with the desired topping. The bars are then transported through a cooling tunnel, where the coating is solidified. The cooling process is carefully controlled to prevent any deformation or melting of the bars, ensuring that the final product maintains its intended appearance and consistency. Once the bars are coated and cooled, they are ready for packaging. High-speed packaging machines wrap each bar individually, often in materials that provide a barrier against moisture and oxygen to preserve freshness. The packaging process also includes labeling and coating to ensure traceability and compliance with regulatory requirements. Factories utilize advanced packaging lines that can handle a variety of packaging formats from individual wrappers to multi-pack boxes, enabling them to meet diverse market demands. As demand for nutritious snacks grows, the protein bar market is expected to reach $6 million by 2029. Efficient production and continuous innovation are key to meeting current and future market demands.